Hi everyone, my name is Sandy and I'm a YouTuber based out of Los Angeles. I create videos around fashion, beauty, I also create lifestyle vlogs, but this week I'm actually taking over the EF channel as their guest vlogger. I've been living in LA for about two and a half years now and one of my favorite things about living down here is the beaches. So I want to take you along with me as I explore and discover new beaches around the EF school that you can go visit too. So let's get going! First, we're heading to Sunset Beach, which is actually tucked away behind a residential area, so it's a bit more private and secluded. There are small pathways between houses that lead out to the beach, and then you'll find there's a lots of room to run around, even some volleyball nets if you like to play, and the best part is it's not too crowded, so it's a great beach for just relaxing. You can bring a book to read, a journal, work you might need to catch up on. I like to dip my feet in the water, watch the waves and ships, and just get lost in my thoughts. Okay, we're going further down the coast now to our next destination. There are honestly so many beaches, so if you're not picky, you really could pull over anywhere and find your beach spot. But for now, I want to take you to Huntington Beach Pier for those of you who are social butterflies and want more action and life around you. This is a great beach if you want to meet new people and make new friends. There's so much you can do here. The pier is right across from a shopping center, so you can go check out the stores. You can also rent a bike, play volleyball, go fishing on the pier, surf. Huntington Beach is known as Surf City USA. I love walking down the pier and going out over the water. I think it's fun to look down and out into the ocean. It reminds me of how small I really am in the grand scheme of things. This beach is about 20 minutes by car from the EF campus in Costa Mesa, so you can easily take an Uber or taxi to get here. Public transportation is also available, but will take a bit longer. Next, we're headed off to Corona Del Mar. This place is a beach and a park combined. It's about 15 minutes away from the campus by car, but if you don't have a car, you can easily take a taxi or public transportation. My favorite part about the beach is the jetty. I love walking down the pathway and being so close to the water. You just have to be a little bit careful during high tide and when the waves are strong. There are lifeguards around, but again, just be careful. I also love that there's this large rock structure you can climb on. I think it's really fun to do that. There are also fire pits available, so it's a great place for bonfires and barbecues. There's also a large cliff area that you can climb and get a better view of the surroundings. And it's also a great spot for photos. Last stop, we're heading to Crystal Cove State Park. This place is huge. It's tucked away in the mountains and there are some beautiful hiking trails across the park, so lots of sightseeing can be done here. It's a bit easier to navigate and get around to all the stops with a car, so keep that in mind if you want to visit. If you're feeling adventurous, you can go through this tunnel to get to the beach, but they also have a shuttle you can take from the main parking lot. I love this beach for its little tide pools and rocks where you can observe little sea creatures. This beach is a good in-between if you want some Something private but still want to be close to civilization. There are restaurants on the shore, but if you walk further down, you can get some more privacy. One of the park rangers also told me this is one of the best places to watch the sunset. So this is Crystal Cove. It's the last stop of the day. I'm just gonna chill out here and watch the sunset. I just wanna thank EF for allowing me to guest vlog on their channel. I had so much fun visiting and exploring all these beaches today. I hope you had fun too and got some ideas of some things to do while you're here. Until next time, bye.